This is 7 News. Tonight, the Supreme Court appeal over three strips of sticky tape. WA's boom to bust suburbs, where houses sell for just over $200,000. Anger over push-up bikinis for seven-year-old girls. And an Eagles injury blow, the latest live from John Rosfold. From the studios of 7 Perth, Rick Arden. Good evening. We begin tonight with breaking news in the case of a dad who threw his four-year-old daughter off Melbourne's Westgate Bridge. Seven News reporter Laurel Irving, the jury has delivered its verdict. Yes, Rick, about an hour ago, Arthur Freeman was found guilty of murdering four-year-old Darcy Freeman by throwing her off the Westgate Bridge two years ago. Now, the jury took five days to reach its verdict, rejecting Arthur Freeman's argument that he was mentally impaired at the time, suffering a dissociative disorder triggered by depression and did not know what he was doing. Now, Freeman showed no emotion as the verdict was read out in court a short time ago, and nor did his ex-wife, Peter Barnes, of course, Darcy's grieving mother. But several people in the, inside the courtroom at the time were in tears, including several of the jurors. Now, the judge has made it clear he wants this case finished as soon as possible. Of course, many members of the Barnes family are from Perth and they've been over here for the trial. So the judge said tonight he wanted to see here pre-sentence submissions on Friday and Arthur Freeman will be sentenced before Easter. So just repeating, Arthur Freeman guilty of murdering his four-year-old daughter Darcy in Melbourne. Rick.